What is up guys? Welcome to RAM Overload and today I'm going to be talking about how you guys can control two different computers with one mouse and one keyboard. Okay, so meaning, you know, you have two, whether it's a laptop or two desktops or two laptops, you can basically make the mouse go seamlessly from one computer to the other computer. Okay, normally you would have to have two keyboards or some kind of switch where you'll have to like unplug it and plug it into the other machine or something like that. But this way is a lot cooler and it works a lot better in my opinion. And it's basically, you can use this free tool called Mouse Without Borders. Okay, uh, it's by the Microsoft, it's by Microsoft. Uh, let me just expand this. Okay, um, Microsoft Garage Mouse Without Borders. Okay. Um, it's from their Microsoft website. I'll leave the link in the description below so you guys can download it. The details, um, it's pretty small file, so you don't need to worry about that. Uh, requirements, you know, if you're work working on Windows at least 7 or up, it should work perfectly fine. I'm running Windows 11. Um, it's not listed here, but it's still working perfectly fine on that as well. So, how do we get it? So, you know, you just want to download it, and then I, I believe it'll be like a .msi file or something. Right, um, and then you can just double click to install it. I already have it running, which is right here. You guys can see. And these are the two computers that I have connected to it. This one, the one on the left where it says local machine, that is the computer that you guys are seeing right now. So this is running on here. All right, and this other computer is basically the other one that I am connected to. So you guys can see I can connect up to four different computers right um and the cool thing is you can orient them in any way you like so you know if you want to put if i want to put the computer the other computer that that i have on the left side of this uh, i can do that you know it's it's a lot cooler and um you know a lot very simple to use so the way the way this works is you want to install this on both computers right um and then once it's on both computers you want to basically just you'll see uh, the security key. You want to enter this security key into your other computer secure, um, key over there. And basically, then you just connect, right? And it should automatically work. You'll be able to move the mouse without any issues. And also the keyboard, the way the keyboard will work is whichever screen the mouse is on or whichever computer, I should say, the mouse is on, uh, that is the computer the keyboard will work in. So if I have my mouse on this screen, the keyboard is going to work on this computer. If I have my mouse on the other screen, the keyboard will work on that computer. So it's just wherever you put the mouse. Um, that's the first thing. And then the, also you can do other IP mappings over here. And then there's also some settings you, over here. You want to warp the mouse, meaning, you know, once you hit one end, you want to come back to the other computer. Uh, I usually keep it off because it's kind of annoying doing it that way. Uh, this way kind of keeps it more authentic, you know, more seamless. You know, you really won't be able to tell there are multiple computers. So, you know, you're probably wondering why would you want to do this the best thing I can think of is if you have a work computer and then also a personal computer uh, or a work laptop and a personal computer, right? Um, it's pretty annoying typing on the laptop keyboard and the mouse and you want to use one keyboard and mouse with your personal one. You can easily just move it left and right. That is if you're able to install this on your work computer. Um, so yeah, uh, the other computer, you just install this, uh, put the security key and that's all there is. Okay, um, you can do option two rows if you want. Um, it's that doesn't really change anything, but that's pretty much it. You know, you just have to be on the same IP, right, or the same uh, connection, I should say. So if you're on Wi-Fi, your house Wi-Fi on both computers, it'll work. But you know, let's say if you're on some other Wi-Fi on one of the computers, uh, it's this will not work. It's only locally on your LAN. Um, so you got to just make sure on that. So yeah, um, I hope this tutorial helped you guys out. You know, definitely check it out. It's really cool. Uh, let me know what you guys' thoughts are. Other than that, don't forget to subscribe. Hit a thumbs up. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.